Sean Sewell with Ingimit.com, the beautiful mouse of Colorado, testing out the Wubin X2 flashlight, this guy right here. This is a really cool, compact, side-by-side, -side, powerful, three LED, 2500 lumen waterproof flashlight. A lot to cover, so let's get into it. So Wubin sent over this X2 about a month ago. I've been using it uh, here camping. I'll show you a picture where we're at right now. It's a pretty sweet spot. Um, the packaging is worth mentioning. I don't really care about packages so much, but it's actually pretty cool how they laid everything out. And in the box is actually something really cool. Um, and I overlooked it the first several weeks of using this. Um, one, there's this little cap right here that goes onto the light to diffuse the light and also give you a little um, red light right there, which is nice for soft lighting in your tent or in your vehicle um, or just, you know, when you don't want a huge amount of light. So that's a pretty cool feature right there. And then <laughs> this, I thought it was just a lanyard and then I was looking at the instructions a little deeper. Um, I was like, I don't care about the lanyard. Like, people throw these into stuff all the time as a little perk and I never cared about it. But you should care about this one because it's actually how you charge it. So there's a USB-A right there. Come on, focus, USB-A. And then, yep, and then a USB-C right there. So, thank goodness, this is a USB-C charging device. Right there, you can see USB-C port. Yet, somehow it's still waterproof, which is bonkers to me. I don't know how that works because this right here, uh, I don't know how that works, but I've had it in snow and rain. It's actually, it actually was raining until about 10 minutes ago uh, and it's worked fine. So there's a clip on the back. It's already built into it. You can remove it. I'm not too sure what size hex keys those are, but you can remove it. The lanyard can go through, as you can see, kind of like right here, right there. And then um, this is the high-end version. Uh, depends on how you view high-end. Let me go over the specs real quick. Um, so this one has Ostrom P9 and three of them right there. The other version has Samsung LH351D, which some people like. Um, I don't know why, maybe the coloring's different as far as Kelvins and stuff. Uh, the Samsung version of this light is 1800 lumens peak. This one is 2500 lumens, which is bonkers. So, it's hard to show you in this video, um, but I'll show you a video I shot at night last camping trip. And you'll see why I'm shooting this in the dark. It's actually pitch black right now. It's a lot of focus. The iPhone 13, there's the Wubin right there. We're going to turn on one click and, you know, there's a flashlight. Very helpful flashlight. And with two clicks, let's blow your mind. Boom! <laughs> 2,500 lumens. Yeah, that's extremely... Right, 2,500 lumens, crazy. Back to off. So one press and we have low, and then there's the high beam, 25. It's, it's not gonna show up very well in evening light we have right now, but it's pretty cool. And there's different modes too. You can hold it down and it'll dim and go higher stages. Um, it's there's you know, there's modes. Uh, strobe, for, in case you wanna induce a seizure or, or attract attention. Um, but the mode I most care about is low and, and high, <laughs> high. So, um, low is very useful around camp and, uh, you know, daily use. But I'll tell you the truth, last time I was camping up this spot, and I'll show you this spot. It's pretty majestic. Got a rooftop tent coming up here in a second. Yeah, it's pretty cool spot undisclosed location, of course. And I actually do a lot of backcountry skiing and splitboarding up here too. Oh, it's so pretty, I gotta show you guys. Don't wanna give away too much. Up there is where we go. All right, back to the review on the, the flashlight here, which is what you came for. So, um, back to the story, I started. We're up here camping, my dog Chloe and I, um, about a week ago, and we heard wolves. <laughs> never heard wolves up here. Foxes, sure. Moose, 
um, big cats, but never a wolf. So immediately put this guy to use in the bright mode, scanning the terrain, along with a couple other um, Wubin flashlights, the headlamps I sent over. And actually, <laughs> something worth noting, it does get kind of warm. Like I can feel that heat from that far away. It's, it's warm. Um, and also I blind myself just now, <laughs> never look into a bright light. Okay, it's off. So all these features come in right around $98 uh, for this package with the charging cable, which I think is pretty flippin' genius. Um, yeah, it, it's a new company to us. They reached out to work together and boom, goes in like that. And um, the packaging is nice. We also have a headlamp from them as well as the favorite light of mine, the X2 is really cool. Might be an X3 coming up pretty soon here as well. But the, what I like is the, the magnetic light they sent us that'll just stick on the side of the truck. Uh, and I'll do that in a separate review up next. But yeah, they, they're like, I think they're the biggest or one of the biggest flashlight manufacturers in China. So people who know, uh, know about Wubin. They're new to us, like I said, but they sent over a few things for us to use. And so far, I've been really impressed. One last gander at this everyday carry side-by-side -side flashlight. This is the black version with the Osram LEDs. And again, that is the more powerful of the options available. So I'll put a link below if you want to purchase one. Um, it is an affiliate link and supports the channel, but it doesn't cost you any more money, of course. As always, uh, if you have any questions, put those in the comments below. I'll do my best to answer them. If you have experience with this, and I know there's going to be a lot of people out there who have used this before. There's like a lot of flashlight experts. I'm not a flashlight expert. I'm just a person who uses a flashlight. So these are my observations of using it here where you see us using the gear. Uh, if you appreciate this content, a thumbs up always is appreciated by us. Uh, we have a lot of cool reviews coming out of more reviews on Wubin and a whole lot more camping gear because we're ramping up for what people consider camping season, even though we camp year round in the snow. But uh, we'll have a lot more camping gear to check out. So if you want to see that, consider subscribing to our Engagement YouTube channel. Until next time, take care. Thank you.